Hey, this is Brett with Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Garen Cherokee headquarters. Today we're doing a walk around on this 2020 Jeep Grand Cherokee Altitude Edition. And we're just gonna do a walk around on it, do a little bit of a review. The color is Sting Gray on this Jeep. Really a good looking color. It's been popular among Jeep fans. Kind of a ceramic gray, I think. I think that's what it was called on the Dodges, is ceramic gray. But a really good looking color. And so we'll just do a walk around here so you can see all the styling points on it with the altitude package. Obviously, it's got a lot of black on it. Accents to that sting gray. And then we'll get up close and go into the actual options on this particular Jeep. So this one has the premium lighting group. Gives you the HID by Xenon headlamps, the LED running lights, the LED fog lamps. And part of that altitude package, you'll notice the gloss black uh, bezel around the fog lights there, the gloss black lower valence, as well as the gloss black trim on the grill, the gloss black Jeep logo on the front as well. Stingray, one of the uh, really good looking colors for this year. You get the 20 inch gloss black painted alloy rims and Bridgestone Dueler tires on here and they are 265 50 R20s. So those are 20 inch rims. They have a highway tread on them. And as you go down the side here, you'll notice the gloss black Grand Cherokee lettering and the uh, painted color match mirrors. This one has the enter and go system. We're just gonna take a look at the original window sticker here. Uh, 3.6 liter in this vehicle, 25 miles per gallon on the highway 18 city for an average of 21. Has the start stop um, capabilities as well. And then this is the Laredo or the altitude package. So this is all the stuff that you get with that altitude, including up to here. Um, then the premium lighting group is a $695 option. Feel free to pause this video at any time so that you can take a look at everything it has, but it also has the nine amplified speakers with subwoofer. 43,275 is, uh, is the MSRP asking price for this vehicle. Obviously there are rebates and incentives, but you'll have to check your dealer for those current incentives in your area. It goes by zip code. Also notice the gloss black around all the windows here. Matches the wheels real nice. LED tail lamps, chrome tipped exhaust. Get a really good idea of that stingray color. This is a power lift gate. Back storage area is very clean. You do get a full size spare tire back here. And then that nine speaker system, that's your subwoofer right there. Those seats do fold down nice and flat. And to get this gate down, you press this button. It'll beep at you three times, and then it'll begin its descent. Actually beeps a total of four times, but on the third beep, it starts going down. And down this side, um, I think we hit all the major um, outside points here. This one has blind spot, heated mirrors. And then finally, it does have the capless fuel fill, which is a really nice feature. You're never gonna get gas on your hands. Makes it real easy, just goes right in there. Power windows, power locks, power mirrors. You got the nice dark wood grain trim on the doors and dash. Uh, the altitude package is gonna give you the leather and suede interior. So these center insert pieces are suede. You get the power driver seat, lumbar, factory floor mats throughout and uh, auto headlamps it has the tilt and telescopic steering wheel and this truck was or this jeep was a dealer trade to us so it's going to have a little bit more miles on this it has 903 we got this one from pennsylvania um, on kind of a unique dealer trade but that's why the miles are on it. it has cruise controls on the right bluetooth and information center controls on the left and audio controls behind the steering wheel i like that they really haven't changed the steering wheel on the jeeps rams chryslers 
much in the past probably six, seven years, you get really used to how a steering wheel works. And then, you know, if you switch different vehicles, um, it's nice that they're all pretty uniform. And especially with new model years and stuff, they, it, keeping it the same is a nice feature too. You'll notice the gloss black around the radio and around the climate control buttons there. I, I wanted to leave this up, so there's a winter weather advisory that has been issued for Sheboygan and Fond du Lac here. And it tells you the start time and date and end time, which I thought was really cool. Um, you can even show it on the map. And I believe that's all part of the Sirius XM um, weather stuff that you get with this vehicle when you buy it, no, buy it new. Um, it comes with a one-year trial, and that's the Sirius XM uh, Traffic Plus or possibly the... Um, Guardian Connected Services. I think it's the Guardian Connected Services that gives you all that weather updates and everything on there, but really cool stuff. Uh, you can do your heated seat and heated steering wheel controls right here. Take a look at this backup camera. Really nice and clear. Has the dynamic grid lines on there as well. Um, and I didn't even have to put it in reverse to check that out. You get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. So this is the 8.4 4C radio. 4C really means that it's the next generation radio from the previous radio. So the design is a little different than the 3C. Um, also, you can't add nav to this one, but it either comes with nav or it doesn't. But the one cool thing about this radio over the 3C is that you can have Android Auto and Apple CarPlay uh, hooked up to this radio so you can project your phone onto the radio which makes it nice if you got navigation that you like on your phone you can just project it right to the radio and uh, it's gonna do what you need it to do the eight speed automatic transmission kind of has a silver with a little bit of a tan hue to it um, center console here cup holders with uh, lights in them that wood grain dash trim, really good looking. You do get your home link system and your map lights right here. And last but not least, you get an SOS and assist system in the rearview mirror. Those are uh, hooked up to the radio. Augs and a USB, two USBs and an AUGS jack plus a 12 volt in there. Uh, they don't do the SD card anymore. And we'll take a quick look at the back seats. Much of the same back there, not much over a year over year model change, but always nice to point out that it does have the latch child safety system. And you do get a 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in back here. And just to see how these seats go down nice and flat. So if you got golf clubs or something, you fit them back here real nice and easy. The other thing uh, is that these seats do recline a little bit. Um, hard to do when you're holding a camera, and uh, but they do recline. Got the wood grain trim on the back doors as well, and you also have the child safety locks there. So we're gonna do one more quick walk around and as always, I'd like to thank all my viewers for checking out the video. And uh, remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video. And at the end of this video, there's going to be a link to click on to check out more new Jeep stuff. we got a lot of Gladiator videos on there, a lot of Wrangler videos, a lot of Grand Cherokee videos. Um, we also have that Limited X video that a lot of people have been checking out. So uh, I'll put a link at the end of this video to that as well. And thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see at our YouTube channel, which is youtube.com slash summit auto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. And if you want to check out more HD videos or more vehicles in stock, you can go to www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle on our lot from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, go to youtube.com slash summitauto. And if you want to check out more in the upper right and upper left in the bottom, 
links to all of our 